Welcome to Prayer and Coffee. Matthew 16, Jesus said, I will build my church, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. It's Sunday morning, time for the church, the body of Christ, to gather in each local assembly. In fact, the Greek word for church in Matthew 16, ekklesia, literally means assembly, a gathering of people for a purpose. And in 1 Corinthians 12, the Holy Spirit, through Paul, describes the church as the body of Christ, connected to one another, each adding their unique strengths and abilities and spiritual gifts to the whole body in each local assembly. We need one another. We are connected through Jesus Christ, the head of the body, to one another. We are stronger together. Ephesians 4.16, the whole body joined and knit together by what every joint supplies according to the effective working by which every part does its share causes growth of the body for the edifying of itself in love. In Galatians 6, and let us not grow weary while doing good for in due season we shall reap if we do not lose heart. Therefore, as we have opportunity, let, let us do good to all, especially to those who are of the household of faith. Let's pray. Jesus, the church was your idea, the ecclesia, the assembly of your followers together as the body of Christ on earth. And Jesus, I thank you and praise you for your gifting and calling on my life for your unmerited favor and grace. I come before you to seek your presence today at your church at Community Haven. Lord, in every church, in our communities, our cities, and across America, bless your pastors and elders with your weighty presence as they preach and teach your word today in your church. Be with me, Lord. Prepare my own heart for this morning when you speak to us as your people. Extend your gracious forgiveness to me that I may come before you with a clean heart. Renew a right spirit within me. Keep the truth ever before me that to obey is better than sacrifice. Help me to be obedient to you in all things. Fill me with your spirit. Grant that I may serve you by serving others. And Lord, allow me to speak for you. Give us your word for today and confirm your word by Holy Spirit. In the name of the one who desires to present her to himself, a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle, Jesus Christ. Amen.